Doctor, is IVF painful? Lot of people fear that IVF is painful. In an IVF cycle, the cause for pain can be at different phases. In the stimulation phase, when we give injections to stimulate your ovary to produce more number of eggs, for doing that, we give daily injections called gondotrophins, which can produce a small amount of pain at the site where the injection is given. The next point where a pain can happen in an IVF cycle is during the process of egg pickup or picking up the oocyte. But hardly any pain will be there during the procedure. The reason is it is done under short general anesthesia and after the procedure there will be mild tenderness in the uh, lower abdomen and very very few people have significant pain which needs an additional tablet. The third phase where a lot of people feel that pain can be there is at the embryo transfer phase. In fact, at and during the embryo transfer phase, there is hardly any pain. So, embryo transfer is practically a painless procedure. The other area where a woman undergoing an IVF cycle can have pain is when she develops a complication called ovarian hyperstimulation in which too many eggs get developed and the ovaries get ballooned and then lot of eggs are produced and this complication can be associated with accumulation of fluid and in this it is also known as ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome. This is both a painful condition and a medical complication. In other words, in a normal IVF cycle, during the injection phase, during the egg pickup phase, during the embryo transfer phase, there is hardly any pain. The last but not the least is the emotional pain of waiting for the result and the escalation or the joy of a positive result or the depression of a negative result produces a lot of emotional pain. In fact, I personally feel the physical pain of IVF is not so much compared to the emotional pain that is associated with an IVF cycle.